Hi, this is Josh from MYOB Enterprise Solutions. This video is a look at the project workflow in MYOB Advanced. Projects let you manage and account for self-contained jobs or other endeavours undertaken by your company. A project can have set start and end dates and its own budget, costs and revenue. You can create a project directly from the project screen, but the workflow can begin before that. You also have the option of generating a project quote, which is then converted into a process. And if you're using advanced customer management features, you can start the process from an opportunity, which is used to create a quote and then a project. Starting in version 2019.1, MYOB Advanced lets you create a project quote in advance of creating an actual project. This lets you take advantage of all of advanced quoting functionality in your project accounting. You can create a quote on the project quote screen. The new quote has tabs where you can enter estimates of labour, material and other costs, any tasks associated with the project, and billing and shipping information for the customer. If you select a project template, the tasks from that template will be loaded into the Project Tasks tab automatically. You can print out a copy of the quote from this screen. If you've set up an approval map for project quotes, you can submit the quote for approval using the standard approval functionality in MYOB Advanced before sending it to the customer. Alternatively, to generate a project quote from an opportunity, click Create Quote on the Opportunities screen and select Project Quote from the Create New Quote window. This creates a project quote linked to the opportunity. The opportunity's ID appears on the project quote window, and the project quote appears on the opportunity's quote tab, allowing you to print or send out the quote directly from the opportunity screen. Once a project quote has been processed and you're ready to go ahead with the project, you can go into the project quote, make sure you've selected a project template, then click Convert to Project to create a new project based on the quote. The quote's ID appears on the Summary tab of the new project, and information for the quote is carried across to the project. The Cost Budget and Revenue Budget tabs of the new project are populated with budgets based on the estimations from the originating quote and the project template you selected. Whether you've created a project directly or generated one from a prior step in the workflow, once it's created you can begin managing and tracking its progress. For a new project, you can select a project template to automatically set up the project with general settings, tasks, employees, equipment and so on, or you can set them all yourself. The Summary tab includes options for setting the start and end dates for the project, choosing currencies that the project will operate in, and defining which areas of the MYOB Advanced system that the project will integrate with, as well as a range of flexible billing options. You can set a regular billing schedule or use on-demand billing. The Tasks tab contains all of the budgeted tasks for the project. This is separate from the actual tasks that people will need to perform on the project. Those are set up and assigned to people on the Activity History tab. Common tasks are available for fixed price billing and for billing time and materials, or you can add a new task and set all the details yourself. If anything comes up that's outside of these budgeted tasks, you can deal with this by editing the tasks or by using the Change Order functionality. Full budgeting and accounting functions are available for every project. Detailed budgeting is performed on the Revenue Budget and Cost Budget tabs, and a summary of all project balances is available on the Balances tab. You can view the transactions associated with the project using the buttons on all three of these tabs. Budget forecasting is also available for projects as of the 2019.1 release. A separate video is available on this topic. You can assign employees to the project. If the Restrict Employees option on the Summary tab is ticked, only these employees can create activities, timecards, and transactions on the project. Similarly, the equipment assigned to the project is listed on the Equipment tab. If the Restrict Equipment option is ticked, only these items can be used on the project. When the project billing action is run, all invoices created for the project appear on the Invoices tab. You can open any of these invoices to view their details, print them out, or send them to the customer. As well as printing invoices, a full range of project-related reports and inquiries is available. The project functions work with all of the usual features you'd expect from MYOB Advanced. All of the usual approval functionality is available, for instance, and you can work on projects from the advanced on-the-go mobile app. This includes management functions and employee functions like timesheet entry. And that concludes our look at the project workflow in MYOB Advanced. Thanks for watching.